Okay, tonight we're going to make some ojingo bogogi, or some squid bogogi. Basically, we're going to pan fry some squid with a spicy sauce on it, but it's going to be nice big pieces. I have here two tablespoons of red pepper paste, or kochijang. I have two tablespoons of soy sauce. I have two tablespoons of sugar. I have one tablespoon of rice wine. This one's sake. It's a Japanese one. Not really Korean. But you know, you can get sake in Korea too. I have one tablespoon of sesame oil. One tablespoon of sesame seeds. Two tablespoons of green onion. I have half a tablespoon of garlic and a quarter, no, half a teaspoon of garlic and a quarter teaspoon of ginger that's been minced up. And I'm going to mix this up. All right, let's prep our squid. Now I got, I bought clean tubes. These are already the skins off of them, the tentacles off. There's no, all the guts are out. These are easy to work with. Take cut it. Now I'm going to take this side and I'm going to score it with the knife. Now I'm going to turn it around and I'm going to score it this way. See, now it looks like a mango. And we're going to cut it like this. Pieces about like that. Okay, I have both of my squid tubes cut up. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take my sauce and I'm just going to pour it on here. We'll let this marinate for about five, ten minutes. Okay, my pan's getting hot. We'll put a little oil in here. Now I'm going to start putting this, the ojingo or squid in there, and I'm going to try to put it the scored side down. That needs to be hotter. Now when it tries to curl up, we're going to flip it over. 
Now, squid cooks pretty quick, so it won't. It doesn't take long to cook. All right. Then, as they get a little cooked on, get as, when we get both sides cooked, we want to take them off. If you, do, if you cook them too long, they'll start to get tough, and we don't want that. You're looking at probably about two minutes per side. And just keep moving around in the sauce. Mm. And just keep adding them. Our squid is cooked now. And what we're going to do, we're going to take all the sauce and we'll put it in the pan. And we're going to give the old jingle one final toss with that. And now it's all caramelized and nice and sweet. Thick. Always, the question is, how does it taste? Mm. Tastes good to me.